Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be checking the accuracy of this eye gauging EZCAL digital caliper and we'll find out just how accurate it is. Some people think this is a cheap caliper that is not a very good tool because it doesn't cost a lot. I think it's a bargain because it doesn't cost a lot and it gives you very good accuracy. So this is my set of feeler gauges. This is the side with the numbers. I'm just going to turn it over. I don't know how thick any of them are now. And we're going to measure some and find out just how thick it is. So let's check this one. This is a 0.019. And that's a 0.019. So that was dead on. They're not all perfectly accurate though. Because this does have a plus or minus 001 accuracy tolerance. And it could be wrong by 0.001. So there's a 0.012, and that is a 0.012. So those two were dead on. Let's pick a thinner one here. So this should be thinner, I think. That's a 0.0105. So it's got to be a 10 or 11. So that is a 11, because they don't have a fifth in there. Let's try another one. So I've been pretty accurate so far. Let's see this one. 0065 or 7. It's kind of showing 7. So that's a 007. So that was almost dead on. It was within 0005 of an inch. So that's really accurate. And let's try this one. 004. And that is 004. So we'll go even thinner than that. And let's try this one. And that's 002. And this is a 0025. So it couldn't measure the extra 5 because it's not accurate enough. It is within 0 0.001 of an inch. So let's set 001 of an inch on this caliper. It's going to be a little bit difficult. And I'm just trying to set 001 here. And there we go, 001. And I'm just going to zoom in. And that's just how thick 001 of an inch is. So this is how accurate this caliper is. And I'm going to just take the thinnest one here. And let's see what this one measures. This is the thinnest feeler gauge I can get. And that's 0 0.001. So that is the tolerance of this caliper. It does say 001. And this is a 0015. So I think this caliper is truly amazing for its price. I'm going to have a link down to it in the video description. And I highly recommend it if you need an accurate caliper. If you found this video useful, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I'll be posting more car, home and other repair videos in the future. Thanks for watching!